Do you know the word orchid actually means testicles in Greek? The world of plants is surprisingly erotic. Stick with me as we go and explore a garden where nature, beauty and sensuality come together in a playful way. Hidden in the midst of the green rice paddy fields of Meirim, about half an hour away from Chiang Mai in Thailand, the erotic garden celebrates the beautiful landscape of the human body. As you step into the garden, you'll be greeted by many erotic sculptures proudly sitting among vibrant, suggestive looking plants. This is the garden of Miss Katai Kaminga. Once upon a time, Katai had a dream to have a garden that expressed the deep connection between nature and sexuality. And this is not a woman who only dreamed, but erected her dream into reality. This is a symbol of beginning of life. So join me now as we go meet Miss Katai and explore her magical, uplifting garden. So if you're not into erotic art, maybe um, you could... Miss Katai! Yes, my welcome um, to Erotic Garden. Thank you so much for having me here. I can't wait to get started. Although I don't know, I'm not sure. I might blush along this tour. <laughs> right, okay. Let's okay. explore that then. <laughs> this is our garden, starting from here. Okay. And you can see that we have a lot of statues and carving. Do you have this yes. phallic structure as umbrella stand? Yes, that's right. This is really, you know, popular. <laughs> <laughs> umbrella handle, I think. That is my handsome boy, I thought. Your handsome boy, that yeah, was? The golden one. <laughs> How does your husband feel about this? I think he, he understands and he supports because it's actually with our mom and dad, we won't be here. Oh, yeah, that's true. You know, it is... says erotic feeling is part of human DNA. Okay. As long as you open mind, you, you can feel relaxed about that. Mm, yeah. But normally in our society, we don't really talk about that. Like that, that exactly, it's not appropriate yeah. to talk about that. Yes. You know, even in the family, it's not really talk about that at all. Yeah, I don't have conversations like this with mom and dad. <laughs> right, it is a new world. <laughs> the world of freedom, yes. erotic garden. This is like an erotic sundown. Oh, erotic sundial? Yeah, oh, okay. you see. Erotic sundial, but if you look at the shape in here, depending on how you see, maybe you think about lipstick. Oh yeah, yes, it's lipstick. Have you ever thought where the lipstick idea come from, by the way? Oh, yes, the lipstick is a very powerful tool. Yeah, the shape is inspired. Shapes, yeah. Oh, what is this plant? It's so yes, beautiful. Yes, it is. Uh, they come out once a year, uh -huh. and they call uh, orange jade. Jade. Oh, yeah, jade, 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 jade vine. Yeah, jade wine. Ah, jade this wine. is the orange. They have a green jade as the well. The turquoise color. Yes, the turquoise, but we call green. I heard that the green one is more difficult. Oh, yes. Yeah. Yes, that's what I did. <laughs> that's why it's not here. <laughs> I think this one. Yes. If you have the green one, they probably come out not often when mm. they boom. You know. I, I remember like they need the cold to kind of trigger also the flowering. I'm just not sure. I leave it like a let it grow as uh, whatever. Natural. Huh? Yeah, natural thing. Okay. Yeah. Wow, what oh, can you see hello. in here? <laughs> My eye uh, is drawn to you this. Capture it up. Yeah. How tall it is, you can measure it up there. <laughs> you can measure it. <laughs> wow. It's perfectly manicured. Mm -hmm. If you come by this angle, mm. you could see it in all its full That's glory. Right. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> How often do you have to, you know, keep trimming it? Mean, once a week. Once a week? Yeah, or every 10 days. Yeah. Wow, okay. Hey, yeah. I see your husband over there. We can call him in. Joe, would you like to be He's okay. shy, he's, he's blushing. Shy. Yeah, he's blushing. <laughs> you see, let the because woman these are... just enjoy. <laughs> because okay. maybe, you know, you were inspired by him throughout <laughs> this <laughs> entire garden. <laughs> <laughs> you mean with, with what? With Is the that sizes? model after your... <laughs> you mean with the sizes? <laughs> <laughs> right. Okay. Have okay. you seen this? Oh. Oh, look at this, so cute. A ladybird. Yeah, it's coming and with what? It's, 
It's eating your um, cannabis. Yes, yeah, cannabis. Yum, yum. Yeah. A cannabis eating ladybird. <laughs> what will happen to it? I like yes. to try. I've yes. never seen the kind of yes, real yes. plant. Yes, just squeeze so it. Yeah. And then you can smell the mm. fragrance from it. It smells like a herb or some peppermint. Yes. Peppermint smell. It smells it's very called Thai stick. Mm. If you look at the other side, you see this is all of my suggestive peel. Are it's we... like a fruit vegetable in there. I get the idea because when I roast the coffee bean, mm -hmm. and I see the crack at the front, oh. and I see the round one at wow. the back, and the, I, my imagination, wow, the back it should be like a bomb, and the front, the crack should be. Oh. We, oh, oh yeah, you're right. That is the bum ah, at the back, and there's exactly. this tiny slit in the the front. Okay. That's right. You have to come up with that imagination. You huh? see, they're erotic and everything. And yeah. everything, actually, <laughs> you know. I want to show you the flower. Okay, oh. finally, got this one. Uh huh. Oh. So viewers, what do you see? So, so comment under below what you think this is. <laughs> oh, look at that. You can hold them. <laughs> my little boy. Your little boy. That's my little girl. That's your little girl. Okay. Mm -hmm. If when we look at this, mm -hmm. it's going to remind mm. people about what is it? It's a part of the woman, right? Yeah. And next yes. to that is... Oh, oh my God. Okay, yes. <laughs> so it's sitting in a hmm. monk, some How do we bushy it? grass. Yes, bush. Bushy. It's a bush. Yes. It's a bush. <laughs> yes. And then, yes. Yes. And which color? Can you see that? Hmm? Down here. Uh, green and white. And right. supposed to be like gray. Right? Gray. And okay. you can tell how old is she now. Oh. <laughs> uh, aging gracefully. I said it's a mature. Yeah. Mature. A know, mature. It's, yeah, it's, it's, yeah. And just leave her alone. Mm. Right. We don't do anything, leave her alone like that. Yes. Yeah. It's, this area is what a chicken farm. It's what? Chicken farm. It was a chicken farm? Yes, and then turned chicken farm to erotic garden. <laughs> <laughs> you have great visions. Yeah. As you can see the pears in there. Oh. The green one is just like the young one. Uh-huh. <laughs> but the, the old, yeah, this one is more like that. After women, they have a baby, they are a bit prompt, but they still look sexy. Yes. It doesn't matter, you know. So beauty you know, can be in all shapes and all sizes, shape, exactly. short and plump, or tall and slender. Exactly. <laughs> Depending on what you want. Mm. If you could see even, uh, you know, the front way inside here. Oh, yes. You can feel that. Yeah. Oh, it's, <laughs> oh, it's a very realistic size. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe you see in Malaysia too, but you yeah. never thought about that. Yes. But when you see everything in the, at the erotic garden, suddenly is everything is everything come up is with suggestive. That. Yes, it's uh, suggestive. <laughs> You're right. Mm. Okay. Oh crap! Can you see the a hermit crab? It's still alive. That is so strange. Because we have a oh, farm, rice okay. farm in here. Oh. You see, and this is come from the rice farm. Oh, yeah. How interesting. Crab yes, in the garden. The crab in the garden. <laughs> yeah, the around the garden. <laughs> Everywhere. Everywhere you will find some surprise, you know. Oh, tell me a bit about this. Ah, what do you think? So, uh, it's a man that's lying down and. Uh, Male or female? Um, it looks like a male. <laughs> You have to look at the back and you know it's a male or female. So it's a female? It's a female, yeah. Her... And what kind of pose here? When I the don't child say pose that, it's for the yoga. child's pose, it's yoga pose. Yes. You know, it's the most popular, yeah. I am most uh, flexible mm -hmm. in human body. Mm -hmm. 
even uh, be born with this pose anyway. Oh. And it's the most erotic and most sexy pose. Oh, really? Yes. I never thought of it that way. Mm -hmm. I I'll try that on my husband. <laughs> <laughs> and, and I tell you, yeah. this pose, if you have insomnia. Insomnia? Yeah, like can't and sleep. then can't sleep. Yeah. You do it, it's like a put a hand up, oh. back and front, five times. Okay. Uh, five minutes, sorry, and uh, it's going to help you with the sleep. Mm. Good. So if you can't sleep suffering from insomnia, yeah. you can work on your child pose exactly. like that. Okay. But make sure you put the hand. Uh, but, but the hand one in and okay. one out. Okay. Exactly. And it could also be very erotic pose for your partner. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> why not? I'm learning a lot of things in this tour. Yeah. Okay. Oh, oh, is oh. that your coffee oh, bean or something? No, it's a plum. Plum? Yes, yeah, a plum. It's a lot of fruit when they're overripe. Uh -huh. They split. Oh. And then the crack. This normally is, uh, uh, what you see is slit. like, I uh, give you uh, some suggestion. Mm. But the most important thing is the color. Oh. Depending on the color, what you want to use. If you use the pink, it's more like a little girl, you know, we love pink, you know. Oh. It's the red, it's more like a mature oh. color. This okay. is, that's what I use. The pink one is more like a virgin. Oh, my 17 years old. Girl right. It's the virgin. If you look back from this uh, angle, you can see okay. that. Mm -hmm. The curve, you can see the, the bum, yeah. upper leg, lower leg. So that's like the, the bum, yeah? Mm, like a woman yeah. laying on her stomach. The landscape of the body, body mm, art. Mm, that's correct. You know, mm. this is what, not just sculpture, I recreate the landscape as mm. well to be erotic. And now, I would like you to see this. Uh, okay. What can you see in here? Hmm, it looks like the, yeah, two balls. Two balls, you know, it's a testicle, that's it. As you know, it, in real, they never the same anywhere. <laughs> you should add a man. It feels the same, but they never look the same. Ah, oh, okay. The same like our, our food. Yes. One side is feel mm -hmm. bigger than the other. Okay. But we just get used to that. That's what I said. Nothing is perfect in real. Yes. It's just your appreciation is the most important. You like it or mm -hmm. don't like it. Mm -hmm. Or it's so so or whatever. This is what is all. It's about nature. Yeah. Nothing is wrong. Yeah, there's always some variation. Everything is a little different and mm. unique. Mm. Our bodies as well as for plants. Yes, come to the Rotic Garden. Come with their own imagination as well. Ah, ah. look at this. Hello. Everything is erected. <laughs> so a lot of people said, why you have three to die? Mm. And they said, no, no, once enough, three is too many. Each three is too crowded. Yes. <laughs> but I don't know what to put the two. I just keep it together, okay. you know. And that is why, why I have three. Actually, for, for also like art and design, uh, yes. grouping of three is nice. Uh -huh. Like an odd number of things is nice. Oh, okay. Yeah. It's better than two or four, oh, so three right. is better. Okay. But it doesn't happen, no it plan. Happen. Yes. Okay. And the reason I put next to this together, because just try to, uh, you know, explain it, the, what is the most sensitive part in male and female body in oh. general. Oh, okay. And then yes. what is the feeling of erotic oh. starting? Okay. You know, erotic had nothing to do with sex. Mm. Uh, completely. It's to do with your feeling, feeling and your own imagination. Yeah. You see, some more people they can create in their own fantasy mm. as well. You know. Oh, I create this corner for Thai people. Because we are the land of Buddhism, it's part of our religion. Oh. And in here, we make it to represent the human thought, human mind, oh. to divide to four levels. Okay. One is the group of the people. This, the lower one, like this group, they don't think of anything. Mm -hmm. You know, and that's what we call this group, like uh, they have no brain. 
Oh dear, yes. <laughs> and this group is a uh, second level. It's more like a people. Everything is up to you, up to you. Okay. They not really want, don't want to make decision. Okay. You know. Yeah. But the tallest one there, mm -hmm. the people, they always, they always think about themselves. Me, 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 me. Uh, I'm right all the time. Okay. Everyone is wrong. Yeah. But if you see this one, is the biggest like, one. The biggest one is like a people, they open mind. They can thing. connect with everyone. They can everyone. connect it, exactly. Wow. Because in the real world, nobody right all the time and nobody wrong all the time. Mm -hmm. You see, yes. it's learn to how accept to other people's opinion is really important. Mm, Not yeah. just straight away, just people. Yeah. Why? what you think or what you believe. Yes. You know, this is more like a balance everything else in okay. life. Yeah, they life understand. It's not like you have to agree with everyone, mm. but you have an openness to understand them and yes. where they're Love. coming from. That's right. Oh. This is the heaven on earth. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to say no. Ta-da! Ta-da! Some people, they think, oh my God, what is it? Actually, this is a symbol of beginning of life. Mm. Without that, we won't be here. Ah. But you probably want to ask me, how about mom, Katai? <laughs> mom have a lot of detail, okay? Mm -hmm. But for that, one piece sticking out. If you see both of these tree in here. What tree is that? Bomb box. B-O-M-B-O-X. In Buddhism, they said, if you do a bad thing, mm -hmm. and when you go to hell, you have to climb up oh, with this tree, tree like a pot torch okay doing the bad thing mm. that's why i said heaven and hell oh. and which one you want and this is uh from argentina you can see that the different oh my goodness mm. they have very strong and really sharp curl. It looks really aggressive. Yes. And then some has two. Yeah. It looks like durian, mm. but on mm. the trunk. Mm. Even stronger than durian. Huh? Yeah. It's really sharp. And you can see this tree could go up to 20 meters. I think I, I need to take a photo or something. Yes, please. There. And your bromelids are flowering very nice, very well. This one. Yeah, your bromeliads putting yeah. out bright, beautiful yeah. flowers. It's beautiful, especially when they have a strong sun, you know, it's, it's much brighter. Brighter, yes. yeah. Okay. That's right. And now I would like to show you the mm. fruit. You can see this? What does it look like? Oh, Whoa. you want me to say nipple? Is yes. that the right thing That's to say? Right. That's right, <laughs> that's right, that's right. Wow, freak. Yeah, thick. Yeah, yeah but mm -hmm. it's wow one because we cannot eat it. And you can see different shapes sometimes, you know, he, even human boobs, some is, is not perfect. You know, yeah. The way they come. Yes. It is like a showing nature. It's in different shapes and exactly. sizes. Exactly. <laughs> yes. Oh. I want you to see this. What is What am I catching? You the can crack see that, right? in the trunk, okay. And yes. you can see the muscle. The muscle. Yeah. yeah. Miss Kata is extremely observant. <laughs> <laughs> it's nothing can escape from my eyes, you know. Yeah. And this woman, she's emerging out of the wall. Yes. This is going to give you like a, the idea uh -huh. of the idea of the perfect. Mm. Okay. Idea of bread shape. Yeah. Let's say. It's according to the uh, plastic surgeon from England. Huh? When I, it's they, they come up with the article from yeah. that article, and then is I come up with the, oh. these statues. And we have to measure out everything as to what they say. You mean the plastic surgeon say, okay, this is the perfect size and shape of a breast mm -hmm. that you constructed according to that? Exactly. You're right. Wow. And this is what is come out okay. close to what they perfection. say. Perfection. Yeah, perfection. That's wow. exactly. You can see the face. Mm -hmm. She's so proud. Yeah. Yes. Only one. She's like out. Oh, okay. yeah. Happy. <laughs> and then. Oh, that, that lady looks very happy. She's dreaming. She's dreaming. <laughs> it's dream. our icon. It's the dream. I call it the dream statues, you know. 
the dream statue. Okay, yeah, and she's dreaming. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and uh, you can see that is the face is come with a happy, relaxed, like in bliss. Mm, you're right. Some some women love to sleep with the side pillow. Ah, uh, yeah, yes. And this yes. is how we dreaming. You can see that it's really. Very beautiful. Yeah, she has beautiful Shape, back yeah, and arch. Back, yeah, thing. And this is the idea of what the tattoo art as well. A what? Tattoo. Oh, tattoo. Yes, because yeah. now the tattoo is really popular with the new generation, mm -hmm. you know. Our, yeah, yes, what's so. at the side of her thigh here? It's, it's a, a peacock. peacock. Yeah, you can ah, see that. Actually, yeah, it follows the line of her body. Exactly. Yeah. When this woman stand, you can see the head will be here. Yeah. Even she wear the short okay. pants, you can yeah. see only the feather down here, right? Ah. You won't see that. Depend on that. It, it's more... Yes. Not in your face, you know. Yes. It's more like a mystery. Uh, what is in there? What's you know? in there? Like you have to imagine what's exactly, there. Exactly, exactly, exactly <laughs> right. Uh, this is my handsome man. Your handsome man? Man, taking a bath. Oh, he's in the bathtub. Yes, bathtub. That is in cute. Here. Go and have a look. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, he is. Uh, he's like reading a porn magazine. <laughs> if you look at this side, this is more like a logo of erotic garden. It's Antonia. Ah, oh, okay. Yeah. If you ask me, what what can they see? They will see. Oh. Oh, a different. Ah, yes. it's how you interpret this. You're right. Okay. But the most important thing is. Ah, right. The, the, He's having an uplifting yes, experience. Yeah. He looks, yeah. Happy. You know, seven out of ten women always walk to that side. Oh. You know why? They want to see. They want to know the sizes. Oh. <laughs> then they want to know the detail about what is he reading. Oh, okay. You see, it's different purpose in both mm -hmm. male and female. For mm -hmm. male, uh, never mind. I just want to know. See what, what he's reading. looking at. Yes. Okay, that's right. But woman straight seven out of ten. Oh. Well, today mm. they want to see what is this to a check surprise. Out the goods first. Okay. <laughs> that's that's <laughs> right. That's right. You can see that. Oh. But down here wouldn't be lonely, right? Yeah. <laughs> Can pass the work. Hmm. Yeah. See, he's got a huge mm. one. Yeah. Katai's husband shared with me something very interesting. In the olden days, big penises were considered vulgar and a sign of stupidity. So art portraying fools, lustful, drunken crude men have big ones. Whereas the refined Greek heroes and gods with their massive rippling muscles were honored with small flaccid penises. As you can see across these ancient Greek art sculptures, the small penis was indeed a badge of the highest culture and civilization. Oh, Heliconia. Ah, oh, this is called sexy pink. If you turn upside down, okay, you will see that it's like a woman too. Oh, that's yeah. It. At yes. the sideway. <laughs> yes. And you know, the women, even they look really quiet. It doesn't mean they don't feel erotic. But they feel erotic, you can see this. Okay. It's like the moon mm. is increasing. Oh. Get inside. Getting, okay. More and more aroused. And then drop. <laughs> okay, now this is our tea, tea house here. Oh. And not just tea, you can have coffee, you can have other mixed drinks as well. Oh, so there. people can come here for yes, coffee and tea right. as well. Of course, not a, because it's a, it's a part of our package. This is the area of the tea house that you can see here. It's really, oh. really cozy. Yeah, very feel like cozy. a home, you know. Yes. I want people to come in here and really feel feel like a home. Yes. I can try your tea later. Yes, yes. I think and I'd... the most popular will be the French Elgrey. I might know? try the creme brulee. It sounds oh, sexy. Brulee. Sexy. I will 
come again with my husband next month. Oh wow! Yes, it'll be good. Maybe we can have something romantic after visiting your garden. Oh sure. <laughs> oh, with my birthday candle. Have you seen my birthday candle there? No. Okay, you should see. That is part of our gift idea too. Oh yeah, his birthday was a few weeks ago. Uh -huh. Okay, there we go. Candle. This is my birthday candle. <laughs> I got a birthday candle because I got it during my uh, birthday. And this is from Bhutan, this is from Hindu. Okay. You see, actually it's all it is, is a part of religion. Oh. Especially in Asia. This is symbol of female. Yes. This is male and they worship it. Oh, oh okay, I get it. Yeah, the, they the call it lingam. Lingam. Lingam is mean the all whole thing. Days, not just one thing. And right. then you have something very colorful going on. Yeah, and this is your conceder. You can draw it as well. No, I'm not <laughs> gonna do that. <laughs> it, oh, this is almost, you know, important is like a... Oh, a bottle opener. opener. That's right. And also you can hang it up like this. Ah, okay. You know in Bhutan, mm -hmm. why I put above the door? Uh -huh. You do keep the bad spirits away. The, the bad spirits, spirits away, because yeah. this scares them. This scares them. <laughs> so thank you so much for hosting me around and opening my eyes to see things in a way I never saw before. You're most welcome. And I hope to see you here, okay? I want all the people to have experience like you. So guys, I highly encourage you to come to first Chiang Mai. It is a wonderful city for a holiday. And while you're here, you have got to check out the erotic garden. So thank you guys. If you have enjoyed this episode, please do subscribe. And then I would see you in my next video. Bye-bye.